So speaking of that, let's start with gracilis, okay? So I'm going to pick his leg up, move it into adduction, and bring it across the table so that the leg is in adduction. Now notice, I did not try to correct the rotation. I just moved the leg into adduction, okay? Now, standing facing the foot, I'm going to monitor right in here. Gracilis is in that middle range of the compartment, so it's not too anterior, it's not too posterior. So I'm going to monitor right in the middle. I'm going to reach down, put my elbow on the table. I'm going to take his foot so that my fingers are on the medial edge of the plantar surface, and I'm going to compress straight up. Now his leg is already in adduction. Now I'm creating a direct line of medial compression. Okay, we're going to hold that for our 20 to 45 seconds. Let that go. And before I repalpate, I'm going to bring his leg back out to a more neutral position because that's where I palpated before. So I want to make sure I'm getting a good read and I know what's changed. Now this will release gracilis. It'll also release, do a general release for the entire compartment. So you might get quite a bit of release out of that one move. Now before we move to our next muscle, let's talk about using that move that we just used as a gracilis move, as a general adductor compartment release, and coupling it with vastus medialis so that we can get rid of adhesions between medialis and the adductors. So once again, I'm going to move his leg into adduction, adduction. And then I'm going to come into a lunge, put my forearm on the table, my elbow on the table. My fingers are on the medial aspect of the plantar surface of his foot. I'm going to create a direct line of medial compression. Now you can see that my monitor hand is right in between medialis and the adductors. I'm going to create a direct line of medial compression, lift the leg up from the table so we're in slight extension at the knee, and then I'm going to medially rotate just slightly. If you cannot get medialis to release, this is probably your issue, is that you have some adhesion between medialis and the adductors. So you really need to come in here and release that adhesion. The move's a little more complicated. You're really going to have to stretch your body out, but it'll give you a fantastic release here on the medial side.